We've all been there. You want a brilliant adventure outside, but you're just not feeling like a hike. Well, today I've got you covered because we're going to cover one of the best views in Kelowna and you don't have to hike to get there. I'm Nathan and this is The Trail Underfoot. This is a video in my series exploring some of the best hikes in the Okanagan, but today I'm doing something a little different. We'll be taking a look at an amazing peak in West Kelowna that you get to via a 4x4 trail, Blue Grouse Mountain. I've always been intrigued by this location because I can see the radio towers perched atop Blue Grouse from my house in Kelowna, and I thought it high time I take a visit. The access road is called Blue Grouse Mountain Forest Road and it can be found off the Bear Creek Forest Road just north of the campground. The entire road has excellent cell service, but I always advise having a good map either with a GPS unit or with a dedicated off-road app like Gaia GPS. I'll make sure to link both Gaia GPS and the Garmin GPS unit that I use in the video description below. The road is part of the Bear Creek OHV trail system and you're required to buy a trail access pass to the Oak Okanagan Trail Riders Association website. Make sure you visit that site and pay the fees before you make your way up to the mountain. The road is pretty obvious, but there are definitely lots of side trails, and the first quarter of the drive along Blue Grouse Mountain Road can be a little confusing. Indeed, we made an ambitious run up a steep ATV trail and had to back down after realizing it was not meant to be. The road is perfectly passable, but I would definitely recommend a proper 4x4 and high clearance vehicle as this is meant as an off-road trail. It takes about 30 minutes to ascend the main road with lots of spots along the way to stop and enjoy the view. You'll first arrive at a clearing that has recently been logged and the first radio tower. Keep going for the main event. The summit is marked by a series of radio and cell phone towers, and then by breathtaking vista of downtown Kelowna and Okanagan Lake stretching for miles. The summit sits at about 1,280 meters, so it can be a bit windy and cool at the top. We were also eaten alive by mosquitoes, so be prepared if you want to stay, eat some lunch and enjoy the view. This is obviously a popular spot and there were plenty of beer bottles and remnants of bonfires as evidence. Don't be one of those people, so pack out whatever you pack in. This is a short but fun drive to an incredible view of Kelowna and the Valley. Pay your trail fees and make sure you have a high clearance vehicle and you will not be disappointed. What do you think? Is Blue Grouse one of the best views in Kelowna? Let me know in the comments below. And as ever, let me know where you think I should go next. See you next time.